I guess I avoided him for the same reason as a lot of people in the neighborhood. He was notoriously known as the stolen bike guy. But when I actually sat down and started talking with the guy, I found him absolutely compelling. Look, I had the other day somebody coming and says, you buy hot bikes? I, said, well, I don't know, are we talking for one minute or one month, right, about the topic, so. Yeah. The next day, I came back with Jason Gilmore, who's a filmmaker, and then the two of us shot extensively with Igor for, for the year and a half period in which, until he was arrested. I never said much to Igor. I really mostly just let him do all the talking. So back home, I was flushed with junk because we were poor. Yeah. And here I'm flushed with junk because people are ignorant. I tried to make myself as invisible as possible and just watched what he was going to do. Essentially, we were scavengers for footage in the same way that Igor was scavenging for crap on the street. <laughs> 